Just mention this. This came out if you've uh, watched sports television, if you're a fan of that, uh, you know, over the last three decades. Uh, our condolences go out to uh, John Saunders' family today. John Saunders uh, passing away today. He was 61 years old. I worked with John for 14 years at ESPN. Um, he was everything that you think he was if you watched him on TV over the last 30 years. He was, it's a cliche, but he was a pro's pro. He had that sensibility about him where he was, he was kind, he was smart, um, he uh, was opinionated, uh, but he didn't blast people. He had a good time out there, you know, he, working with, uh, you know, Dickie V and, and, and Digger Phelps and uh, all the legends of ESPN that came up and we all watched through the 80s. Uh, I remember doing, a, a, I was doing a Big Monday, the early uh, games, and he would come in and do the late games. And I'd have all my notes, kind of like what I have here, all these notes and everything written down. He would come down, he'd plop down his rundown. We'd have a rundown of the show that you'd get from the producer. He'd plop down the rundown, and I would say, John, that's it? You got no script? You have no notes? And you'd say, no, nah, no, nah, I got it. And he would go through and roll and not make a mistake for the next three hours. He was just that good. There's not many guys that I would look at in broadcasting and say, that guy is really good. And John Saunders was one of those guys. Uh, he had diabetes. Uh, his daughter also was a type 1 diabetic. Uh, we would go down every other year to the Children's Congress to get funding for the Juvenile Diabetes Research Foundation. That was something that was near and dear to his heart, to raise funds to help his daughter. And, uh, and he dealt with diabetes his whole life. Uh, we don't have a cause of death. We don't know that yet. Um, but again, just a, a sad day. It was devastating just to hear that earlier today. And he is, and I'm sure for a lot of people that uh, are thinking of this today, you know, he, w he was part of that. And even, I worked there for 14 years, but I was, even before getting out of college and uh, being college age with, you know, with, with Linda Cohn, and then we both go to ESPN later. Um, and I remember with Linda Cohn watching ESPN and thinking, boy, someday we can get there. It was special in the 80s. You know, it was, it was, it was something that was different. I think we're all feeling that. And John Saunders was a big part of that when it was special. And ESPN was special uh, in the sports landscape. And again, our condolences go out to, uh, to everyone who was touched by John Saunders. And he was, uh, you know, he was that good. He was that special. So our condolences. John Saunders was 61 years old. Uh, we'll be back again. Mike Rizzo, Nationals GM. Much more coming up on High Heat.